we started the business in 1987, my wife and I, as a small job shop doing contract work for food service, pharmaceutical, construction, transportation industry. Uh, as the business grew, jobs came in that we couldn't do, and I saw too much uh, business going out the door that I couldn't produce or had to subcontract out. Uh, back in 96, we bought our first water jet machine because of the versatility. Uh, what I found was that it could cut anything. It didn't matter what it was. So I was waiting for the 90K machine to be available, the pump to be available. As soon as it became available, I was one of the first on the list to have a machine installed. Now, I wanted 90K with dual heads so that I could have a competitive edge and it was with the KMT pump, 90K, with the Mitsubishi table, 6x12, dual head, uh, modern technology. Our 60K machine that we've been running for six years now has, again, the pump is the heart of the whole machine. That pump has been doing tremendous work for us, and our part speeds going to the 90K, our cut rate, is up 65 to 70%, which means I can get twice as much work through this machine that I could before with the 60K pump. It's speed, I mean, we're almost as competitive as laser with this machine. That's how quick we can cut. And, you know, laser, again, is a, is a big market out there, but what we're seeing on a lot of drawings is water jet cut parts only because of stresses and analysis that they've done, our customers that is, on parts that are laser cut, warping, or having stress fractures or cracks or uh, issues with the edges being brittle. With water jet, we don't have that. With this machine, I've got a competitive edge over anybody because we're the only one in the country that has one. Whether I'm running a 100 pump, a 100 horsepower pump, dual head at 60K to 125 horsepower pump at 90K, I don't see an operating cost increase. The only appreciable difference that I have, if you want to call it that, is small utilities, which are minimal at best, because anything quarter inch and below, I'm still running at 60K 35 to 40% of the time. I'm not even running this thing flat out. And Seal life, we expect our seal life, which is the main consumable, if you want to call it that, to be shorter in this. But what KMT's done is they've made seal repairs so simple, they can be done in 15 minutes. The equipment that they've given us to change seals, the new technology of these pumps is just incredible. Our downtime is going to be minimal. Now, with our increased run times, when I'm getting 60 to 70% more material through my machine, that's a small price to pay. I'll take that every day. The KMT pump is truly the heart of the whole water jet operation. I will not put a table in here that doesn't have a KMT pump, that had quality equipment, quality service, and reputation to not leave you stranded. The first thing that, that I liked about Mitsubishi was the quality of the machine. The ability to be able to raise and lower the water level to actually be able to cut either above water or below water and virtually not even hear the parts being cut, which is incredible from a standpoint of employee safety. Uh, the, the software is all Windows driven. It's very user friendly. It's basically point and click. The garnet removal system is second to none. I would stress that any new first-time water jet buyer looks strong at a pump. You've got to be an educated consumer. It's critical.